Hello guys, so today we're gonna test the damage of Asura Strike Gulotan Feast or Extremity Feast, whatever you want to call it One Punch Man <laughs> One Hit Delete So yeah, I'm gonna remove my cards first To see the real damage or The damage if you have less cards or less stats, low level so I'm not gonna allocate my stat point first, all in one. So ayan yung equipment natin. Uh, tidal set, two rings, strength ring, and may card ako na Angeline puppet for SP, and cute ribbon for SP also, para mas malakas yung Asura. Now, we're going to try it. So ayan, full Asura. Pag full SP ang tawa. Yeah, let's try it. Bam! 233k. 233519. So again, no weapon cards, no stat allocation, all one. Yeah, so, yung target natin ay may 82k HP lang sa PvP room. So, sa PvP room, mas mataas yung HP natin guys ha. Not sure kung times 3 talaga yun Pero mas mataas yung HP sa PPP no? So ayan, test ulit natin Ilan nga ba? Ayan. so full ulit Full Asura Ayan natin no? Pinag Kairi ko pa siya ngayon Try natin yung naka Kairi Kung mare-reduce ba ng Kairi no? Ayan na Tira mo na guys, tira mo na Hmm 195, so na-reduce Nang Kairi yung Asura Tama ba yun? Na-reduce ba nang Kairi yung Asura? So tingnan natin no So, ayan guys no Ulitin natin na Tingnan natin if Kairi will reduce The Asura strike damage So ayan She used Kairi and let's try Asura 192k so previously when there's no kairi buff the damage was 233k so now let's try assumption so mara reduce ba ng assumption yung asura will the assumption buff reduce the damage of the asura strike so let's try it again now this time with assumption buff but only level 5 for ter testing purposes only guys no? so kanina 233k ngayon naman with assumption 232k so hindi nagkakalayo guys because asura strike gullet and feast or extremity feast ignores death and assumption gives death to the target okay while kairi it reduced physical damage percentage depending on your hp okay kaya na reduce ng kairi yung asura strike okay guys now let's try our asura strike damage to an lk again without allocating our stat point so let's see the damage of Gulletin Feast, Asura Strike, Extremity Feast, 245k for the LK with 180k HP. Again, guys, Asura or Gulletin Feast ignores death. That's why. Now let's put Kairi Ellison. 165k. So the Kairi really reduced the damage of Asura Strike. Will Kairi help you survive Asura Strike? Maybe, maybe not. It depends on your budget. <laughs> Again, I did not allocate any stat point in this test. And the equipment build, you can see it at the start of the video. You can go back there. and Okay guys, maraming nagtatanong kung sulit daw ba yung reward pag naging monk ka. Para sa akin, sulit naman siya, lalo na kung libre pa yung 
pag-change mo ng job, kung meron ka pa nung ticket na libre. Kung wala naman, 1K is a noon. Pero sulit pa rin kasi more than 1K naman yung ma-avail mo dun sa mga bonus reward. So ayan, kung naliligaw kayo, hindi nyo alam kung saan yung NPC, click nyo lang yung Frontera Map, click nyo yung Info, tapos scroll down nyo lang sa baba, hanggang makita nyo si Miss Zoe, tapos Job Selection yung title niya. So mag-autopat na yan pag kinlik nyo siya, at ayan, pwede nyo na i-click at mag-change job kayo. Ngayon, kung ayaw nyo naman talaga ng monk or ng champion, pwede naman kayong bumalik agad doon sa dati nyong job. Kunin nyo lang yung mga rewards, i-claim nyo lang. Pero tandaan nyo, within 24 hours lang yon So, kailangan makabalik kayo bago mag-24 hours. Kung hindi, bibili na kayo ng item para mag-change job na nagkakahalaga lang naman ng 1,000 yan berries. So, para hindi na kayo gumastos at ayaw nyo naman ng monk, after nung makuha yung rewards, pwede na kayong bumalik. At kung nagustuhan nyo ang ating video, eh mag-like at subscribe ka naman. Thank you!